Hello guys, so welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends, welcome back to a brand new Call of Duty mobile video. And today, we're going to be checking out the brand new game mode, Attack of the Undead. Which is a game mode that we all know and love from previous Call of Duty titles, such as... Obviously, Black Ops 2 and stuff, and the Attack of the Undead version of it originally came from Call of Duty World War 2, um, which, which is basically infected. This game mode is infected, in case you don't know. And what the aim of this is, one person will be infected, and they have to basically eliminate all the other players in order to win the game. Every time they eliminate someone, they become infected too. So eventually, the whole enemy team will eventually be covered in infected players, and they need to take down everyone. Or if you're a survivor, you just need to survive down to the very end of the match, eliminate as many of infected people as possible, try not to die, and if you survive all the way through the match, you will win the game. But if the enemies manage to eliminate you and all the other survivors have been eliminated, then the enemy team wins. So it's Target it's one of them game modes. It's a fun game mode. I've loved it in previous Call of Duty titles, but if you are new to it, then that, that is pretty much all you need to do. So this is going to be my very, very first ever game. And to be honest, I think we are on a pretty good map as well. Because standoff is pretty good. At the moment, we've got two people infected. As you can see at the top of the screen, you can see eight and two. The blue side is my side with the survivors. And the red side, where it says two, um, that is the infected. So at the moment, it's time two people are infected. And I'm going to try my best to keep them away from me as possible. They've got like tomahawks on them as well, so they can throw them at me. So, if he says they can't get too close, he can throw tomahawks. So, I'm just going to be careful and try and dodge him. But, obviously, we can have, like, a few accessible like accessible items as well to help us uh, trying to survive. Obviously, we get his own loadouts, which is good. You know, I mean, I can pick my own weapon. Um, but, we've got, like, a sentry gun with us, which is good. So, when that um, is ready after its cooldown timer... Um, Asita's, I'll be able to use that to help me. I've got trip mines that will just obviously recharge over time, which is good. And obviously I've got access to three perks as well, which is good. One of them being scavenger, which or basically vulture in this game. Which is really good, because at the end of the day, we're going to need as much ammo as we possibly can. But, other than that though, it's Target's going good inside. so far. If you'd like me to make more videos on Infected in the future, then you just have to let me know down below in the comment section. But it's one of them game modes where you just got to play smart. you got to find a good spot where you know enemies can't get behind you. And you just got to basically be able to lock it down. And if you're playing it with buddies, if they lock down one side and you lock down the other side, then you pretty much got the game. You know what I mean? You can just basically hold it down. But that's the thing. At the moment, my, my team members... They're too busy running around and going wherever they want to go. So they're going to get themselves killed off fairly easy. You know I mean? They're just open targets. But for me, staying at the back over here, as long as I can lock down this corridor on the right, it makes it tricky for enemies to come running through there because they'll get blown up by my trip mine. So me and my sentry gun can focus on what's in front of me. And hopefully, no one will be able to get me, fingers crossed. Nicely done. Yeah, it's going to chuck in another trip mine down there. Just a corner off that area. Because I keep thinking someone's going to come running through that area and just try and get the jump on me. But as long as it's covered, I should be okay. Because the only way they can get me then is by coming from the fight from forward. From the forward position. So I should be able to see them as they're trying to get the to me. But if they're good at throwing summer hawks, they will be able to get me. So I've got to be careful. Oh no, I'm on my own now, boys. <laughs> it's one against nine. I've got a death machine though, so hopefully this will work in my favour. Bring it, bros. Come on. Last man standing right now. Come on, bring it. Yeah, man. Me and the sentry got on this death machine. We're a good team right now. My other team just like left me behind. Left me to die. <laughs> Come on, we're gonna put this one down. Enemy in sight. Woo! Come on. 
He's taking down, taking down. Check another one there. Ooh, cheeky, cheeky, cheeky. Very cheeky. Got to be really careful now. Come on. We're doing good so far. We're doing really good. Imagine dropping a nuke in this game mode. That would be insane. I don't know if you can, actually. I think you probably could. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fair play. I held my ground, though, guys. I proper held my ground there. But they did manage to get me in the end. I was going to try to see if I can survive the whole game. But it's up to you. Would you like me to play some more infected in the future and just try to lock down the whole entire lobby and try not to die and literally go flawless? If it's something you would like to see, let me know and I'll try my God's hardest best to try and deliver you that as a footage in the future. Um, but... Other than that, though, it's for my first game on Attack of the Undead, or aka Infected, within Call of Duty Mobile. It's been a lot of fun, and I really, really have enjoyed it. Hopefully, you will enjoy it too. Let me know what your overall thoughts and opinions are on the Attack of the Undead game mode. Do you like it? Have you played it yet? What's your thoughts on it? Let me know. And the seaters, and if you want to see more videos on Call of Duty Mobile moving forward, I can give you even more videos on it if you want, guys. I've got plenty more stuff I could be making videos on when it comes to Call of Duty Mobile. I've still got um, locations on the Battle Royale map when I'm going to be showing you some, like, all the locations, cool areas and stuff you can go to, and uh, any cool Easter eggs and stuff, so make sure you look out for that. Um, but other than that, though, it's been a lot of fun, and I really, really have enjoyed it, so hopefully you all enjoyed it too. Right, let's just see how we did, because we should have done well. Hang on. Do, do, do. Very nice. We're level 33 on the Battle Pass now as well. Well, there's 17 more tiers to go, which is good. We've got 26 kills there, boys. 26 and 1, which we, we absolutely smashed it. Um, but, like I said, guys, it's one of them. I'm going to bring this video to an end now. If you enjoyed it, give it a big fat thumbs up. And subscribe if you're new. Turn on the post notification icon. It'll notify you when upload any new content in the nearby future. Thank you for watching. Stay safe. Stay awesome. And I'll see you again next time.